Hi people, it's us, it's Zed and me with a walking stick. Um, not for puppies, um, more for, you know, uh, dogs with uh, growth plates sorted out, but just tricks with a stick. What can you do with a walking stick? This is my walking stick. I hate it. We have a terrible relationship. I avoid using it when I shouldn't. Right, so let's see what Zeddy can do with a stick. Zeddy stick. You've got naughtiness written all over your face, which usually means you're going to play up. Yes, right, Miss Madam. <laughs> right, ready. And front circle, forward circle, come on. No, come on. Sit, come on. No, come on. Forward circle, good girl. Sit, no, circle. Sit, go this way. Circle, good girl. Circle, good circle. Good circle. Circle. Circle, 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 stop, back circle, and back circle, good girl, 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 and stop, and we're going to go front, this way, front, circle, front, circle, both ways, good girl, good girl, good girl, and turn, Back circle, back circle, and back circle, back circle, stop, yes, good girl. So you can do the forward and back circles. Um, honestly, I'd start on your legs first. It's easier to teach a dog to go round you than it is to go round an object. Um, depends on your dog though, because you know, just because Zed can do one thing or another doesn't mean that every dog can or can't. Now. So, the other thing we're going to do with the stick, and I've got to turn the camera angle a bit, is she's really after this food because she's very hungry and she's also very tired, aren't you? I can't see because you're in the bloody way, Zed, and you're still in the way. Right, let's put that there. Right, okay. Now you go over, and you come under, and Zeddy, turn, over, and under, turn, and over, and under. Turn, turn, over and under. Oh, be careful with the handle, darling. I'll put that up. Well, I'll put it to the side. Right, I'll put it this way. Right, hang on, hang on, Sadie. Right, uh, uh, over, under. Yes. Good girl. So, you know, just be imaginative and inventive. Use whatever you've got in your house. You know, you. you just make things up. I mean, I've been, I'm trying to teach Zed to crawl backwards <laughs> or creep backwards. So, right, Zeddy, down, 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 down. Creep, 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 good. Now creep backwards, back creep, back creep, back creep, back creep, good girl, back creep, back creep, Zeddy, back, no. Right, back, down, and creep, 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 and back creep. Good, no, nearly. Down, down, and creep, creep, creep. Now back creep, yes. Back creep, no Z, down, down. Right, back creep, back creep, back creep, back creep, good girl, down. Back creep, yes. Okay, now we've only started that one today, literally. So, um, having palpitations today, something terrible, it's awful. And, uh, you know, but I, I, I think I can get Zed to creep backwards because she's very clever. We had a slight slip in the tree this morning, didn't we? Mm-hmm. Yes, that mummy. She goes, it was your fault, mummy. Yeah, but we just got up and did it again. You know, please remember, if your dog makes a mistake or it tumbles or stumbles, immediately repeat the exercise because you don't want anything fear-based to get into your dog. You know, it, it's... You know, when, when she... I mean, she... It wasn't a bad tumble, not in, in no way did she hurt herself, but, you know, it, you don't want to lose the confidence and, and you know, tricks is, is a big thing in building confidence and it lets the dog get to know about its body and what its body can do, because you can do a lot with yours, can't you? Your mummy used to be like that, but I'm not anymore because I was old. Oh, I know you love me, but I'm still old. Good girl, you're going to do a wavy wavy. Please like, share and keep going, keep going. Share and subscribe. Yeah, I know you're hungry. <laughs> you got to love these dogs. 